Hamish, what's the age of Hamish? They, they, my name is not Hamish. It's not, I thought you were Scottish. No, I'm not Scottish. Scottish. Are you Irish? Sorry. No. But these brothers, brothers you know, your brothers here, I've asked them a simple question. Okay. The question is, what is the age of consent in Islam? That's all I've asked them. But they won't answer. They pointed me to you, Hamish. Is it the Quran, the age of consent? Is it? Well, what is it? The, the, the verse in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned that you will look after the orphans, you look after the orphans. Sorry, you have to. When you look after the orphans. You know, orphans, yeah. yeah, yeah, sorry. So you give them their wealth back yeah. when they reach the age of puberty but, but, or the age of marriage. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. So the ulama have derived from that the age of marriage when a person reaches the age of puberty. However, but, varies, yeah, but that's not enough, age of puberty. Because yeah, yeah. why? Sometimes a girl can reach the age of puberty, but she's not mature enough. Yeah. Likewise, a verse versa. Someone can reach the age of maturity, but has not reached the age of puberty. You with me? Yeah. And the age of puberty? Yeah. yeah, the age of puberty, there's three, three signs for the age of puberty. When the, as for the woman, there's three. When there's the pubic hair, or when her breasts are growing, and likewise there, the, the word dream. Okay? That's the age of puberty. So, so the ulama like Sayyid Tabari, may Allah have mercy upon him, the new Kathir, said safely, when they reach the age of puberty. Uh, but that's not enough. The Mashafi he said, age of, age of puberty is not enough because the person has to be mature enough, likewise. To understand, yeah, mentally. So the ulama do right, she has to be mentally and physically reading. Yes. So there's not a set age? Though. No, because what Islam is teaching you, no, 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 there's no set age. In Islam, you're not allowed to sleep with the babies. Of course, they're not allowed. What, what about uh, Ayatollah Khomeini? <laughs> it's not Ayatollah, it's a shaitan. What about Ayatollah Khomeini? It's a shaitan, it's a shaitan. He wrote a book. Look, I just asked him a question, he's anyway. What's he sex, got to do? Sex Are you with preaching or talking? We're talking? Sex with children and animals. That's, That's good. Islam. He, children he's a, and animals. He's a Satan. He's a Satan. He's a Satan. Send him to Denmark. Okay. He's a Satan. Holland where they have hotels. It is like that. me saying he's a Muslim. He's not Muslim. He's closer to his hand than you. That, that, yeah, yeah. that is like the yes. Mormon saying they're Christians. You don't know about his... Uh, no, hey, hold on a minute. KK is more close to Islam than Christians in the new. Maybe they are. Yeah, so... No. What is the age of concern in the Bible? Are you saying the Shias aren't closer to Muhammad than you? No, no way. Shia. They are far away. They are, they are far away. The, anyway, let's just Did not Ali write no, down when he was with no, Muhammad? No, 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 Ali's not a Shia. Didn't, no, he, no, didn't no. he write down when he was with Muhammad? <laughs> Ali's not a Shia. Sorry, I can't ah. That was your subject. Can you ask you now, what is the age of marriage in the Bible? Yeah. Same question. I don't know. I don't think there is one. I don't think there was one. So any kind. I don't know. I don't and know. It, we have to understand that yeah? Islam teaches you that it's a universal religion. Why? Because, let me, let me, let me finish my point to understand. Yeah. But that, you've got to be Arabic to understand it. No, you don't have to be Arabic to understand it. <laughs> like, no, I don't have to be Arabic to understand there is one God. You have to be Arabic to understand that. Anyway, you let's you understand. Know, universal religion. You don't have to. No. You do, otherwise you can't understand you know, it. He's not Arabic. Majority of the Muslims are non-Arabs, for your information. Please. The Arabs are a minority. Actually, actually, please. Yeah, actually. Yeah. But listen, it's not Muslims are not Arabs. Yalla, bismillah, bismillah. You've got to be to understand. Let's catch this guy because I want to catch people. Because you've got to want an Arab world. You've got to want an Arab Stick to the age of consent. Stick to the prayer points. So Islam, to show you what is universal religion, because we know, historically speaking, that nations, they had a different culture and different of ways <laughs> how to determine when the world, the girl or the boy are able to get married. So Islam leaves that open for the mankind. However, Islam gives you criteria. You're not allowed to harm yourself or harm others. Okay? For example, for example, if the whole world became British yeah. or French, there will be oppression amongst other nations. Because some nations, they function according to their culture. For example, if you go to Eritrea, Ethiopia, or other African countries, the age of marriage is lower than Britain. You understand? Because why? Those girls there, or the boys, is completely different. And Islam, what you have to understand, in Islam, uh, people's culture, let me repeat it, people's culture can be part of Islamic legislation. You with me? Yeah. That shows you Islam did not come to Arabize the people. Because of if, of if Islam came to Arab Arabize the people, then everyone should follow the culture of the Arabs. However, Islam, you, if your culture does not go against Islam, the teacher of God, then you're right.
and I pick you up on one point, and I still have to remember the first point. You say that the, the, the local culture is, is uh, accepted, the local culture is respected. But it's all of that. Ah. It is, no. I said, you have to believe in Sharia to no, be a Muslim. No, no. Whatever so country you are, that... Sharia yeah, no, no. has to no, be no, obeyed. No, no. Do you, can I, are you question? What, why do you ask these questions? No, no, why? Why? Because we're just talking. I want to show you. Me we're just talking. Look, look. Because I you want know? to ask you a question. Well, I'm asking you the same. Are you a Christian? Yes. He's, he's a Christian. Change it. Change it. Was was it. He's a Christian. Was it difficult? But it's carry on, carry on. What? What I want to ask you a okay. question. Okay. Calm down, guys. No problem. First of all, you went. You completely said you have to believe in Sharia. You have to believe in Sharia. Look, 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 look. I know now Sharia term is becoming business for people. I know that. That's why you are using it. No, no, no. That's not the reason I'm using it. Do you have a problem with Sharia? Sorry? Do you have a problem with Sharia? Problem with it? Yeah. Yes. So you have a problem with God of Moses? He's not the God of Moses. Okay. This Allah just okay. means God. No, baby. He is no not problem. the God no of problem. Moses. Okay. He is not no the problem. God of Moses. So when, you must understand this. Let me finish this. my point, okay? Right. Yeah, it? So when God in the Bible, the Old Testament say, kill a woman, burn her alive, whose God is that? Silence. Unlike like it's silence. Not silence. Number 31. Yes. It's not so silence. So who's that good? Who's that good? I don't know which verse. Okay, that, get that verse. You show me the okay. verse. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Let me answer. No, it's my less. turn to answer. No, I'm You've asking you. A, no. Do you have a problem? No. You have, God I allowed you to speak. Yeah, no, no, no. You have to let me just oh, answer. I, and you've asked me another so question, question. And I have to answer so it. Show question. some respect. So my question. You said, is it which God is it? Yeah. If it's true what you're saying, yeah. if, fine, God said it. Yeah. So, is that, so what is your problem? My problem is, is, that morally, is, is it morally good or bad when God said to do something? Today, it's morally bad because we have Jesus Christ that fulfilled the law and brought the love of God to okay. okay. so you. But in those days, they didn't know the love of God. They only knew law like you Muslims that live by law. No problem, no problem. That's so, why you cut hands and feet. So, so, oh, because you live God. by law. So in the Old Testament, when God said to kill babies and children, was that Jesus? Okay, that's a very good question he's answered, oh, is it, and yeah? I'm going to answer it. All right. Please do. Thankfully, Hashim is keeping quiet here because he's showing respect to his elder here. <laughs> you see, for 400 years, for 400 years, for 400 years, God had warned the Canaanites, you are bad people. That was not my question. Hey, you Jesus. see, hang on a minute. Let me answer. He's trying to justify. I'm not justifying. I'm telling you. You're justifying. You see, the, the the Canaanites believed in pagan gods and a god called Moloch, I think he was, that was made of bronze, and the the, the people used to put newborn babies into these molten hot hands of this god that used to be burnt alive, and the the parents were screaming because of the screams of the, the, their children dying. And they used to play the drums louder and louder so that people wouldn't hear it. So God had them annihilated because they were doing terrible things to each other. Those are my questions. Yeah. Well, so my question was, was God. Yes. No, no was yes. it Jesus? Yes. So is Jesus all loving all the time or sometimes? Jesus is just. No, I ask you that. Yes. Is he all loving? Yeah, you have asked me and I'm answering you. Is he all but loving? you have to know what just means. No, I'm asking. Sometimes I'm, you might have to smack a I'm young child just. I'm on the just. legs lightly no, I'm, because that's just. I'm, I'm not saying just. Yes. Is he all loving? Him. Yes. So when he was saying, Jesus said, kill the babies, was he all loving when he was saying that? Of course he was. So, that, that, so killing the babies, no. therefore my man is here, is a support of ISIS. What is different between you and ISIS then? ISIS had, from that, from that time, ISIS had two, had 3,000 years of being civilized and knowing civilization. You know who's ISIS? You know who's ISIS? You know ISIS? But, you know ISIS? but they you haven't learned nice, anything nice. because yeah, you, yeah, still, yeah, yeah, you still, you still, you know ISIS? You still live in the desert, you still live about? in the caves, you and you ISIS still want to cut people's heads okay off. To kill. You still want to cut their hands off and throw people off the buildings. Yeah, ISIS is your Islam. 
Sudan is your Islam. ISIS, the new. ISIS, we have to be just. I've never seen ISIS saying, let us kill a baby. But you have no problem for the babies to be killed. Take I'm care of yourself, mate. explaining to you something, That's my friend. So you have no Listen, leg no. to stand on. Yes, no, my friend. Because anybody understand. knowing this will Even. read it in the Old Testament and they will see that these Canaanites were the evil of the evil. So babies people. were evil. God warned them for four hundred You just justify years. killing babies. God you just justify killing babies. You are four hundred years. We have a Christian here justifying killing the babies. And, 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 and he cleaned them, them out. Of you. And you see, yeah, take care. that yeah. was how many yeah. years ago, my brother? Yeah. How it's not that many years. No, you least, see, we you don't justify live in killing the babies. You are justifying it. No, no, no. We don't live in the desert now. We live in civilization. So you believe in Jesus? live in the time of Muhammad where people oh, no cut problem. their hands you, and feet no off, problem. Listen, left them dying, no. have sex with their wives in front You're of them as they're dying. No, we don't You're live in these times. We, we are right. civilized no people. So no we are no. civilized no. people. No problem. We are civilized. That's good. We, we live under civilization. Understand, understand. What we, happened 3,000 no years ago is not happening no today. Problem. No, but Christian. are you more civilized than God? Are you more civilized than God? My question: Are you more civilized than God? Now, are you more civilized than God? People off the top He's of the building me. because There's they're homosexuals. Me. Are you more civilized than God? Are you more civilized than God? By the way, are you more civilized than God? What kind of question is this? That's my question. Are you more civilized? Very logical one. Because you are saying we are more civilized here. Therefore, what happened in the past, it was uncivilized. My we question, are you more, no, no, I'm asking you, no. are you more civilized than God? Because this is a statement of God. <laughs> Anybody listening that was to this smack will know that this is that. just a That was a big question. smack. Why? You are that saying, that you are applying, you God was uncivilized. No. That's it. By, by the way, Shanzi, before you go, I said, before you go, I want to make one point. No, no, let, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. That's what he said. He said we are civilized. Read, read what it says. He gave the reason let's because, know. because let they me, were evil. Let me See what the reason God gives. Yeah, in Samuel, let's read. No, no, numbers. Numbers, numbers okay. But the very first verse. The Lord said to Moses, take vengeance, go vengeance yeah? Go on on the Midianites. 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 And Israelites. Okay. After that, you will be. Stop that, stop that. So the reason he gave is because they were You're evil, evil yeah. people. Yeah, yeah. The reason God gives is vengeance. Whom should I believe? Oh. And now, brothers and Who sisters, should I believe? No, now, brothers, brothers and sisters, Hashim, no. Hashim, the Hashim, great anyway, Hashim, he's God's He's God. He just quoted your Bible. What are you talking about? He just quoted your Bible. Yes, and you're a second deceiver. Is the Bible wrong? I quoted the Bible wrong. Three words, but they don't carry on. Anyway, leave it down. No problem. Let's carry on. 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 Let
or uh, the likes of uh, what's his name? Have one Spencer. I forgot his name. Full name. They are liars, Islamic haters, and they are disbelievers in their Bible. Likewise, Christian princes. Now I'm this person who always in his bathroom hiding in the toilet. Now I'm, this guy, he, people say he's an atheist. He's a disbeliever. Why? The argument that he tried to use against Islam clearly got against the Bible. So if you reject it, you have to reject the Bible. You have to believe your God was uncivilized. I would just, so if we're civilized now, and what happened in the Old Testament was back then, therefore your God, I think, your God, he was a caveman. Naam, that's what you believe. We don't believe that, alhamdulillah. But I, they say Prophet Muhammad lived in the cave. Prophet Muhammad was a human being. You don't believe God was a human being. Naam. So your God, he was more, more evil than Stalin. Everything is kill, 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 kill. Nah. Naam, so alhamdulillah for Islam. And Islam is a religion of peace. Naam, sometimes in Islam, there is time when you wage a war. Like now, the countries wage a war against ISIS because they know the only way to establish peace in Syria by fighting against ISIS. So there is two types of war. There is a praiseworthy war and there is a blameworthy war. The praiseworthy war, when you engage in war to establish peace. And that's what Islam came with, okay? To establish peace and to defend the those who've been oppressed, okay? And against the oppressors. I hope that is clear. And if you want to learn about Islam, alhamdulillah, we have some videos on our channel. DUS Dawah channel. Naam. You can check the videos and inshallah we'll put many websites for our brother Abu Ayyad that you can read. Allah knows best. Subhanaka Allah And I want to clarify something as well. That the way I, sp I spoke to that guy, if there was another Christian guy who was sincere, I would speak to him nicely. But those guys, they are here to Allah against Islam. So I, I, would, I have to speak to them differently. Naam. Barakallahu feekum.